Our European journey begins here. Destiny is in my own hands and that's probably not the best thing for us. Welcome back guys to the FIFA 23 Hearts career mode. It's been a shaky start to the season. There's been some okay performances but there's not been enough good results. We have one win at the opening six league games. We need to change that today. We need to get another win on the board in the Sench Premiership, but more importantly, we need to get off to a good start in the Europa League. We are taking on Sepski, OSK. They are from uh, Andorra, Romania. They're from some shithole in Europe. They're stepping in for RFS who are not in the game, so we need to make sure that they step out and step out quickly. Before, well, actually, we're going to throw them out. Hopefully, we throw them at the competition. We're going to beat them so bad that they're not even going to play the remaining five games in this group stage. That's what that's the visions that I had in my head. But whether that pans out on the pitch, I don't know. But I think there's too much win games today. I'm not going to go into this game thinking, well, it's the first game. A draw would be okay. Nah, man, a draw is not okay, man. If we can use like a, let's use an analogy, right? There's this Sepsky. OSK is this like hot chick that we really really like and, and we want to take her out we want to more importantly we want to take her home we ain't settling for some you know friend zone let's hang out and be friends nah man we want to hang out in the bedroom we want to go all the way and that's exactly what we want to do against Sepsi OSK we want to go all the way we want to get three points we ain't settling for you know what a, a point's no bad please let me hold your hand fuck that Right, we need to go and we need to absolutely annihilate Sepsky, okay, and hopefully that will transform our season and we'll start pumping all the other shitty teams in Scotland. That's what I'm hoping. Whether that pans out or not, I don't know. But before we can pump anybody, we need to go into the press conference and talk some shit and, you know, big up our chances in this game. There we are. There's a Robbie Nielsen. We need strong referees. And I wonder if we're going to get any strong referees. More importantly, I would probably just take a strong performance tonight. I mean, some of the performances have been a little bit underwhelming. Some have been okay. But, yeah, we just haven't really been that good, if I'm being completely honest. But we need to stay calm. Stay calm is the way forward. There's no need to panic. Uh, we won't underestimate. Yeah, we will underestimate, right? This team is shit. They deserve to be underestimated. And that's exactly what I plan on doing. Uh, bad run, we expect, from Hearts team. Can we... Turn it around. We've been off the pace. But don't worry. We're about to put our pedal to the metal. We're about to fucking go into sixth gear. And uh, we're going to be on the pace. Guarantee it. Like a Ferrari. We will be speeding on this pitch. And that will be next. Here we go. The champions. The champions. Dun 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 dun. I don't know the Europa League theme, so we're just going to have to go for the Champions League theme. Screw it, we will be in the Champions League. I don't know whether it'll be at the end of this season, or, or maybe it'll be in like 20 years' time, maybe 200 years' time, but I promise you, we will be in the Champions League one day. There is our group, Group A. We're in Group A because we're first. We're in Group A because we're the best. At least that's what I'm, I'm trying to tell myself that. That's what we're trying to drill into the lads. Now, you might be looking at the formation here, or you might be looking at the players and going, you know what? This looks like a very, very attack-minded team, an attack-minded setup, guys, and that's because it is. I wasn't lying, right? We have, we have to win this game. Make no mistake about it. I have set up this team to go out and get the win, and that is evident in the formation that we've chosen. We're going with both Boyce and Shankland up front. Why not? Two good goal scorers, two guys that know where the back of the net is. We need them to find the back of the net today. So, yeah, Boyce will be starting with Shankland, if we can't score with those two on the pitch, then what are we doing with ourselves? Seriously, if we can't score with them, I think it's time to give up. But now we're doing all the wee needless handshaking, shake their hands before we send them home with a disappointing, you know, smashing. So there you go, we Barry Mackay. We need Barry Mackay to turn up. I don't think he's been that good to start the season. And that's unfortunate because he is our best outfield player. And he just hasn't really been up to scratch and we need them to get up to scratch but there is our team it's Craig Gordon, Kingsley, Halkett, Rawls, Benenjami, Snodgrass, Devlin, Forrest, Mackay, Boyce and Shankland. I've went for it guys I went with a free three one four two I believe or you could just call it a three five two call it what you want I call it destruction I call it 
This team is about to get their ass whooped. Is there any players in there you know? There's none I know. Hopefully we don't know them by the end of the game. Uh, yeah, let's get into it. Let's do it. Hearts versus ASK Seske. And it's up next. Benji, mate. Boyce. Boyce turns around. Boyce is going to try and find Shankland. Actually, no, he's going to try and find Alan Forrest. And he has found him. Good ball off, eh, Boyce? Shank, oh, Forrest was... I don't know who he was looking for. Maybe he was trying to find Snodgrass there. Snodgrass, though, shoots for distance. Oh, off the crossbar. What a strike for Robert Snodgrass. Almost put his 1-0 up there, man. What a goal it would have been. What a start it would have been. Unfortunately, though, denied by the woodwork. Boyce, he's got... Barry Mackay running it wide, it's not a great ball for Boyce. Can Boyce win this back? He can, can he? Devlin follies it towards goal, but it's nowhere near the target. Boyce, Devlin, it's through to Alan Forrest. Forrest coming in from the right-hand side, shot is blocked, it's safe. Oh, but it's not, the referee points to the spot. Was there a handball? I believe there may have been. He's no happy. I'm happy though, we'll see it again, let's look at this, does it hit his hat? Well, that's tough, I mean no wonder he's upset, that is a little bit tough there, I've still no idea how you hit penalties in this game, but we're going to try and do our best. best Shankland, oh he squeezed it in just about there, from Lauren Shankland, the keeper goes the right way, and for a minute I thought it had been saved, but nah, Shankland hit a good penalty, kept it low, put a lot of power on it. And that was enough for it to beat the goalkeeper. Hearts do have the lead in their first Europa League conference game of the season. It might be a little bit fortunate, but we'll take all the fortune we can get. Because let's be honest, we need it. It's 1-0 Hearts. Shit! Oh man, that, I, I just seen it coming. There's not a lot we could do. The ball was played into space and yeah, shite pretty much summed up what I was thinking there. Where is the defence? I don't know guys, I tried to be adventurous, go free at the back, I'm not sure it's working, you just can't leave holes like that man, and expect no to be punished, I'm not sure, we're not going to switch back yet, because we do need to win this game, so I'm leaving two strikers up, but I'm not sure if this experiment's worked so far, 1-1. One, one. Well, we could be in a bit of trouble here, Rolls has just took a bit, Stefanescu is down, Stefanescu is hurt, the referee is pulling him aside. Thankfully, it's only a yellow card. I was beginning to feel the worst there. I thought maybe a red was going to... Oh, and he's been helped off here, so that doesn't look good for him. Could this game be over? At least Rose's game went over. Oh, man, nowhere near the ball. That's a horrendous challenge. Maybe that should have been a red there. Maybe the red... Maybe the ref's got that wrong. Free kick comes in. Headed down. It's away now. It's Cammy Devlin. Can we... Time the run of Barry Mc... Oh, fucking hell, that was horrendous. Boys, oh my God. What is that, man? Half time, let's get into the break here, man. It's not been good enough. I don't think this formation is working at all. We have not turned up. We're lucky that we got that penalty. Even the penalty itself was lucky to go in. Just haven't been good enough, guys. We need a better performance second half, or else we're not going to win this game. And like I said, we need to win this game. We can't afford anything but a win in this game. So we need to sort it out. Big second half coming up. Cammy oh, D. Cammy Devlin plays it to boys. Boys to Forrest. To Shankland. It's Cammy Devlin. Over to boys. That's good stuff. Boys tries to chip the keeper. Oh man, should have put our foot for it. I tried to be fancy there. I tried to dink it over his head and we have just haven't connected with it properly. Well, Liam Boyce got a better chance than that. Arguably not. Robbie Nielsen can't believe it. Don't know why he's clapping. He'll probably be clapping boys in the back of the heat when he gets him into the dressing room. Should have scored that. How get sticks a leg in? I kind of thought that was going to be a penalty there. I'm glad it's not. Don't get me wrong, but I was half expecting the refs to start pointing to the centre circle. Thankfully, he didn't. And now we could be pointing in the right direction. It's boys tried to find Shankland, but we may. Have got really far. Could this be the second penalty for a handball? Could this be? A, I mean, he's pushing through. Oh, I don't know. Is that a penalty? Is it, a, it is a penalty. It's going to be Lauren Shankland to take another one. Can we score our second penalty of the game? Lauren Shankland. Oh no, I put it wide. 
We put it wide of the target. What we did? Oh, I thought it was a good one. I thought we'd struck it well. A lot of power on it. Didn't need to be that far in the corner. Goalkeeper didn't even dive, man. All we had to do was direct it to the left or right, and it would have been a goal. And we we'll put it wide. I mean, great opportunity again. Very, very fortunate, but this time we didn't take advantage. It's a very good ball, actually. Cammy Devlin now. Devlin to boys, boys out to Alan Forrest. Forrest takes the ball in his stride, gets a cross in. It's almost brought down by Barry McKay. Barry McKay will hold on to this. Still Barry McKay. Finds Benenjami. Benenjami now to Cammy Devlin. Devlin out to Forrest. Forrest with a wee step over. Forrest in towards boys. It's oh my and boys has missed for a header. Be about four yards out, man. What is Liam Boyce doing? Right, here we go. Josh Janelli coming on for Liam Boyce and George Grant coming on for Snodgrass as we pursue a winner. Janelli to Shankland. Shankland. Can he find Janelli? He can. Josh Janelli. Step overs. Plays it out to Barry McKay. McKay. Barry McKay loses out there. Ball flicked over to Shankland. It's through to Forrest. Diving header. Oh, it's going to sneak in at the back post. It's not. It's went out for a corner. That was so, so close there. Let's keep the pressure on them. Barry McKay needs a good delivery here. It's not great. It should fall for Ginelli, though. He flicks it down. George Grant follows it. It's another save by the goalkeeper. Oh, man, right. Andy Halliday's coming on. We're desperate. We're bringing on Andy fucking Halliday. Can't we get a good delivery in here for Barry McKay? It's not bad. Look at it, Shank. Oh, it got taken away from him. It's going to be Stephen Kingsley. Kingsley. Oh, what's he doing? Alan Forrest there. Just intercepting the ball. It was going straight for Barry McKay. And the referees gave a... What's he What's he gave here? He's gave a free kick. He's gave... I don't know what he's gave, man. Andy Halliday. It's Forrest. Forrest is through. Oh, Alan Forrest, he done so well, man, to get round the defence. Went right through them, sneaked past the middle of the two centre-backs, but couldn't convert his shot as into a goal. And now we could potentially, no way, lose this match. For the love of God, no. No, 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 Craig Gordon makes the save right. Come on! Ball up. Benenjami. Shankland, right. Shankland, then. Oh, fucking hell, Shankland. Where are you going, son? Barry McKay has just wiped him out. And it will be a free kick here to the remaining side. We're not long left to go, man. We need to get this ball. We need to get it quickly. And it's not falling for us here. That could be our chance to win this game gone. It's a... I don't believe it. I do not believe it. We've lost the game in the last minute, man. Unbelievable. It's... It is typical. It is typical hearts. It's typical us. How can this be? We dominate the game. We create chance after chance to try and win it in the second half. We don't get that what said winner. And then we just get left open at the back. I mean, Craig Gordon, I, I love the guy. But, I mean, I, I don't really love him in this moment. He's not covering himself in glory here. Oh, what the hell is that? I'll tell you what, that's Alexandre Todori. And unless we can somehow get the forward here, nah, referee's not even having it. Referee just blows full time whistle. And fair enough, there's no time left. That is it, it's all over here at Tynecastle. Our Europa League dream hasn't really started in the best way. More of a nightmare, to be to be frank. It's finished. Hearts 1, Sepsky, OSK 2. A game that we didn't deserve to lose. And we have lost it. So, yeah, difficult. It's, it's going to be, it's going to be a long, long way back, guys. For here. Well, in the other game, there was a three-two win for Florentina, which is I don't think that really doesn't really benefit us. Who wins between Florentina and Istanbul? Uh, we travel to Italy next to take on Florentina in a game that we pretty much can't afford to lose. Now we need to get something out of that due to the fact that we lost our opening game. So. I'm not happy. I mean, second half, we created chances. I don't think the formation worked, but we did create chances. But again, at the back, we did look a bit open. We did look a bit vulnerable. And at the end, that proved to be true. Because on the counter, in the last minute, we conceded. And uh, it's not good enough. We need to sort it out, guys. We need to sort it out big time. All right, guys, here we go. Making a couple of changes. Craig Gordon obviously remains in nets. But we've got Lewis Nielsen coming in for Craig Kyle Halkett doesn't 
Doesn't help losing our best centre-back, but Halkett had fitness issues. He couldn't play this game, so Nielsen comes in. Nielsen, I think, has got a future you know, at heart. I think he's got a promising career, so hopefully this start will do him the world of good, of course, up front. We're going with the same trio, Forrest, Mackay and Shankland. I don't know why, to be fair, because they haven't really been scoring goals, haven't really been firing on all cylinders, but we're going to continue to give them a bit of an opportunity, and hopefully it turns around. Livingston lining up with George, Kelly, Olobley, Boyle, Devlin at the back, Pittman, Holt and Kelly in the midfield, and their front three is Shinny, Isma and Bamabula. So, uh, yeah, decent Livingston side, but we need to make sure we get the win here. We need to make sure we get three points. Referee then has gifted Livingston a free kick here nine minutes in for absolutely nothing. I think he just wants to play with us here. It's a strike for Pitt. Oh, my fucking God. It's not only a strike for Pittman, it's a fucking thunderbolt for Pittman. Into the back of the net. I always speak about how good Craig Gordon is. Craig Gordon ain't saving it. Ten Craig Gordons ain't saving that. Craig Gordon could jump in a time machine, get back to his 20s, get back to his prime, and he ain't saving that. Nothing's saving that, man. That is unsavable. It's 1-0 Levy. What the fuck? Also unsavable. Our season, if we continue to lose games, we need to bounce back straight away. We need to win this match. It's as simple as that. Snodgrass. Shankland. Out to Forrest. Forrest brings it down. It wasn't a great first touch, but he does okay. Forrest gets away from his man. Looks for George Grant. Oh, saved by the goalkeeper. Barry Mackay's first to it. It's Snodgrass. It is Grant. Grant puts it wide. That's a great chance for us. Should have bounced back there, surely. With multiple chances. They all fell to George Grant, and he couldn't finish the job. Still 1-0 Levy. And they oh, are, for fuck's sake, man. 2-0 doing. What the fuck is happening? Can't get close to anybody, man. Can't do nothing. and can't close anybody doing. The space, unbelievable. We may as well be a bunch of fucking astronauts with the amount of space we're leaving here. It's 2-0 Livy. It's a shambles. And already, man, the, the season is slipping away. It's like our hands are covered in fairy up liquid. And we just can't seem to grab onto it, man. Fairy up liquid, butter, lure pack. I mean, you name it. Oil, grease. Fuck me. This is shite. 2 0 Levy. Oh, no, what? No, no, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my fucking God. Can't even put that into words, man. What are you supposed to do about that? Jason Holt, former Hearts man, scores against Hearts, gets the third goal of the game, and all three of them have came for Levy. This is the worst of them all. I mean, look at the three players chase. What the? We need Craig Halkett back, guys. That's the answer. We need Craig Halkett back. I mean, can we can we somehow rescue this game? At least it's still the first half. There's still a lot of time. But, jeez, if we play like this, we're going to concede another 10 goals. We have been shocking at the back here. Nothing less than shocking. And it's going to have to change. We can't keep defending this badly here. Grant, it's J Jordan, Jason's Holt's first goal. Fuck him! I don't care how many goals he scored this season. Screw him. Well, to Atkinson. I don't know why he's up here, but we'll take it if he can get his back in. Oh, my fucking... That's why he shouldn't be up there. What a shit shot that was. Completely drags it wide. Right, Atkinson again this time. Come on. Who are we going to try and find? It's Shankland. It's Snodgrass. It's... Barry Mackay, nice wee step over. He's tried to... I don't know what he's tried to do. It's not good enough, though. Forrest still steps back, wins that. Good stuff. Chased his man back. Snodgrass. Grant. Nathaniel Atkinson whips it in. It's, it's a poor ball. Grant heads it down to Stephen Kingsley. Kingsley outside of the foot. And it's straight into the hands of George. All right, it's half time. What can I say? We haven't been good enough at the back. I think we've been okay going forward, but we've faced three shots for Livingston and we've conceded every single one. So I'm not going to sit here wasting too much time talking about it. We need to... I, I've, I accept we probably ain't going to get nothing at this game, but I at least need to see a performance. We need to improve. But at least score a couple of goals. Let's try and get back into the game. Let's keep a clean sheet. I, I think we should be... Let's try and get a draw, right? Let's, we'll, we'll take one step at a time. Keep a clean sheet. 
Pull one, go back, take it for there. George Grant. Grant out to Nathaniel Atkinson. It's back to Grant. It's to Snodgrass. Snodgrass! Another save for George. It will be a corner, but that was a bit better from us. Let's go, Barry Mackay. Needs to swing this one in. It's Shanklin there. He tried to head it. It's going to fall for Forrest. Nielsen. Barry Mackay wins another corner. So, I mean, we are getting forward now. We are putting pressure on them, but we need goals. Ball comes in. Shankland again jumps for it. Doesn't get to it. Uh, Livingston try and clear it. It's going to fall for Snodgrass. Outside of the... Oh, it's another save by the goalkeeper. I mean, George is pulling off a lot of stops here. But we need to try and do something. We need to find anything at this stage, man. Come on. Gee, is it? Uh, inside foot curler. Curled, right? We'll go for this one. Let's go. Mackay. Oh, who is that jumping? It's Nielsen. Surely not Nielsen. He's took a shot. And we might have a way back into this game. There's been a penalty given. It looks like it was a handball. I think it is against Boyce. So we will see here on the reap. Yeah, no, definitely trying to get his hand out the way. But, nah, it's not going to work. And we need to score this. It's going to be Shankland. Shankland here has to score this. And he hits it right at... Oh, man, that sums, our, that sums us up. Doesn't, we cannot win this game. That just sums it up for us, man. Jesus Christ. Right, Barry Mackay again this time. It's flicked away. It's going to fall back for Barry Mackay. Mackay. Trying to back. Another corner. Right. Uh, who, who can take these apart for Barry Mackay? Okay, have we got a left footer? What about Grant? No, Grant's a right footer. Uh, Kingsley. Fuck me. Get Stephen Kingsley to take this. Well, I don't know why Kingsley's not on them anyway. Right, getting a good in swinger here. And hopefully get someone's head on this. It's a good ball. And it's a... Oh, my God. Nathaniel Atkinson wins the header. Right at the goalkeeper. What? I, I mean, I don't know what... Right at, was it right at the goalkeeper? Why can't we score? For fuck's sake, I'm beating... Come on. Th this is a joke. It's an absolute joke. Livingston's got three shots. They've got three goals. And we can't get a single fucking goal. And we've had about 10 billion shots, man. What gives here? Seriously, what the fuck gives? Nothing gives for that corner. And Livingston will try and clear. Can we put a tack on here? Can we stop this counter? Hopefully we can. I mean, pretty much if Livingston get a shot, they're going to score. That's the conclusion I've came to. So we need to stop them really for getting anywhere near our goal where they can attempt a shot. And that's not going to lead to a shot. What? How, how long's the advantage? Jesus fucking Christ, man. Referee plays advantage, then 10 hours later decides to pull it back for said advantage, man. Unbelievable. Kingsley, Shankland. Come on. It's Kingsley. Grant. Snodgrass. Barry Mackay. Barry Mackay. Oh, it saved again. By George, right, we're going to bring on Josh Ginelli here. Oh, can we just need a fucking goal? Can we please get a goal? I mean, a goal now would give us a chance. Barry McKay whips one in. Shankland at the back post. Jumped for it, never got on it. Ginelli will be first to this. Ginelli has got the pace. Whips one in. It's Nathaniel Atkinson jumping. Oh, and this could be the end of the attack. It is. No! Four fucking shot! Four fucking goal! What a joke! What can we do? What, what, what we need to, basically, we have to accept that whatever amount of goals the AI get, that, that how many of shots they get, that's the amount of goals they're going to get. You, you can't do nothing. You, you literally cannot stop them. Un, unbe unbelievable. He, he turns around, he, he shoots, and it's a, it's a good finish, don't get me wrong, but uh, you, you just knew it was good in, man. It's like the. Uh, they've got, like, armed fucking tracking ball right into the back of the net, man. What, what can you do? You can't do nothing. And, oh, uh, this just sums it up here. It's a folly. It's the fifth shot. You're thinking, wow, they actually ain't going to score with this shot. But, you know, the referee's like, nah, don't worry, mate. I'll help you. I mean, that doesn't even hit his hands. That's a joke. That's an absolute joke. Hits him in the chest. Hits him in the stomach. How can the referee no fucking see that? Doesn't want to see it. He's a cheating bastard, that's what he is. Craig Gordon dives the wrong way. Is this the worst defeat I've ever had? It is. 5-0 at home to Livy, man. I don't, even, I don't even have the words. I do not have words. Oh! What? 
Are you shitting me, Kelly? With a strike from distance, you get the whole slow mo thing, and and Craig Gordon, the best goalkeeper in the land, isn't capable of making a save. Is that what you're telling me? Why is this game broken? Why is Kelly beating Gordon from here? I mean, come on. Why is God? Why is Gordon protecting his face? Why is he not outstretching his arm trying to make a save? What the fuck is that? When do you ever see Gordon doing that in real life? Never, never. This is an absolute. Ah, uh, uh, there's not a lot you can do about this game. This this game is done. This match is over. There's, there's no point over analysing it. Yes, I've been shipped. Should never lose six 0 to Livingston. Sacked in the morning. I think Robbie Nielsen will be gone or whatever. Who cares? This is a joke, right? I just have to put this game to bed. I wish I. I, I don't even have the words, man. I don't. I'm, I'm fucking. I'm furious. We just pegged the wrong guy there. Oh, pass there. Doesn't work. I, I'm, I don't know what to do, man. I honestly do not know what, what to do. Grant, ball in towards Shankland. It's, it's headed away. Just want the whistle to fucking blow. It's Stephen Kingsley with one of the worst team efforts you'll ever see into the hands of George. And that is it, guys. 6 0 Livingston at Ten Castle. Fans are booing. Robbie Nielsen, you're getting sacked in the morning. Sacked in the sacked sacked right now. Forget about the morning, right? You can't sleep on a decision like this. I honestly, if it wasn't such a screw job, I'd say sack is right now. But let's be real, that was a screw job. That was the ultimate screw job. Look at that. Look at that. Eleven shots to their seven. Now you might be thinking, well, you said all their shots went in. That's not true. The one shot that didn't go in was the shot that led to the penalty for the handball that wasn't a handball. That, my friends, is an absolute disgrace. There's no way we deserve to lose that game. Never mind lose at 6-0. I fucking hate FIFA at times. I really do. I, 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 what, what can I say? There's some other score lines. And uh, fuck, man, we miss. I don't know, did we miss Craig Halkett? Was the whole game against us? Was it a screw job? Was it EA fixing? I don't know, but we need to fix it. We need to get better. We can't do that. That was that was shambolic, man. I don't even want to look at the league table. We're going to have to, because, you know, closing your eyes and not acknowledging problems is no way to fix it, but we, we stay in 10th. We stay in 10th, but we've conceded 19 goals already this season. We're a minus 10 goal difference. The teams at the top are beginning to pull away. We are beginning to lose ground on these teams, and it is scary, guys. We Next time in the league, we take St. on St. Johnson, and holy fuck, do we need to win that, man. That is... You talk about must-win games. I can't even think of what will happen if we do not win that. So I will have to be at my best. We'll have Craig Halkett back for that. We'll have everybody firing on all cylinders. You know what? Boyce ain't really doing it. Shanklin ain't... I might even give Humphreys a chance in the next... I don't know. We'll see. But we need to be more clinical. We need to put the ball in the back of the net. And we, and we need to stop the AI from getting shots away. Because we just, we've just seen in that game. If, if they score, if they shoot, they score. So we need to stop them from shooting. That's going to date, guys, for episode four. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, we lost. I know people are going to say, lower the difficulty, lower the difficulty. Mate, I, I had 11 shots to seven. It, it's not my fucking... I can't fucking help it if every goal goes in from the AI. It's just one of those things. I'll just have to get better defensively. I'll just have to not allow them to get shots. I will do it. I don't care. I'm not. I'm not lowering the difficulty. I'm going to win this league. It's not going to be this season, but we are going to. We're going to get top three this season. We are going to turn this around, and we're going to make Hearts champions. It's just. It's just going to take time and a bit of patience. So hopefully you have it, guys. Uh, hopefully you can also leave a like, comment, subscription, and um, leave a comment and tell the referees a fucking prick for giving. Livingston a penalty when it was not a penalty, man. It hit Nielsen in the, the stomach and he's given a penalty for a handball. What an absolute knob. Anyway, that's it. Got nothing else good to say. I better quit this video before I get banned or something. So, aye, right, guys, that's it. Bad day at the office. I mean, bad day at the office. It was six fucking nil. Jesus Christ, man. Uh, the office would... If there was an office, it would get destroyed right now, I'm telling you. Every bit of paper, it would be in the paper shredder. Desks would be getting flipped. Windows would be getting smashed. And, um... Yeah, but there's no office. We can't take our frustration out in the office, so we'll need to take it out in St. Johnston next time out. Make sure you tune in, guys. Till then, I'll catch you later. Peace.